My pick this week is a deeply unsettling Argentinian odyssey which divided critics at Cannes in 2008 and has continued to bewitch and befuddle viewers for almost a decade. Written and directed by Lucretia Martel, who made a splash with her early shorts before graduating to features like La Cienega, The Swamp, and La Nina Santa, The Holy Girl, this is a tale of everyday madness by a filmmaker who wants you to make up your own mind about what you saw and what you know. The Headless Woman. Co-produced by Pedro and Augustine Almodovar, La Mujer Sin Cabeza stars Maria Onetto as Veronica, a magnetic central performance. Driving alone along a highway beside an empty canal, Veronica is distracted by her mobile phone and hits something. What? A rabbit? A dog? A person? She seems unsure, as are we. Our doubt only increases as our car pulls away and we glimpse through the rear window something? Maybe nothing. Who can tell? Veronica is mildly concussed, but in the days that follow the accident, her condition turns to something closer to catatonia. As her life begins to unravel, she becomes more and more convinced that she's guilty of manslaughter or worse. You can read The Headless Woman as an allegory about Argentina's guilty political past. The soundtrack is full of songs which take us back to the 70s, when citizens would simply disappear during the so-called Dirty War. Or you can read it as a more universal tale of bourgeois guilt, the return of the repressed, or a descent into insanity. However you read it, The Headless Woman will get under your skin. Tirelessly championed in the UK by sight and sound editor Nick James, it's grown in stature and reputation since its first unveiling. Martel's latest feature, Zama, recently played at the London Film Festival, and we hope to see it in UK cinemas soon. In the meantime, get your head around this.